Hey guys, it's Kristen. And Layla. And we get into the kitchen and share with you recipes that are parent approved. And that kids love. Today, I'm so excited about the recipe. Mm -hmm. I'm sharing with you my all time favorite dessert. Peanut butter cracker cookie. It's just peanut butter that's been sandwiched together between butter crackers and dipped in chocolate. Layla's been making these, I think since she's like, in 16 months, she's been helping spread the peanut butter on the crackers. We make them every year at Christmas time with all of our cousins and all the little kids, and they're just delicious. All you need are three ingredients. You need butter crackers. We use a butter cracker from Whole Foods or Trader Joe's that doesn't have hydrogenated oils in it. You can use whatever you like. We use all natural peanut butter. And then we use some good quality chocolate that we chop and melt. And that's it. That's all it takes. Yeah. They're like a homemade tag-along cookie. Yeah. <laughs> so why don't you show them how you've been making these for years, Layla? First, you want to spread peanut butter on each butter cracker. Make sure you put peanut butter on each of the butter crackers, the top and the bottom, and then sandwich them together. Next, you want to melt some chocolate. Melt for 30 second intervals until melted completely. Take a fork, put your sandwich cookies on it, dip it in your chocolate. This helps the chocolate drain off of it so you don't have huge clumps of chocolate on it. Not that we complain about huge ch chunks of chocolate, but <laughs> the cookie looks a lot nicer if you just use the fork to tap off the excess. Mm -hmm. And then place it on wax paper until the cookie sets up. Try to be patient. I know it's hard. <laughs> it is. It is. And then once these cookies have set up, they're ready to enjoy. They will keep in an airtight container for four days. Um, you can keep them in the fridge for up to a week as well. They're a great Christmas cookie. They're delicious. They're really great any time of the year, especially on hot summer days when the craving hit for a cookie and you don't want to turn your oven on. This is a simple treat that's easy to make. Uh-huh. All right, let's give these a try. Mmm. Mmm. So good. I think they're even better than tagalong cookies. Mm-hmm. Way better. And the salt from the butter cracker just complements the peanut butter and the chocolate perfectly. It's perfectly balanced, perfectly delicious. So easy to make too, right? Right. Well, I hope that you guys enjoyed this recipe. For this recipe and more kid-friendly recipes, be sure to visit amindfulmom.com and hit subscribe so that you can see this little one helping me out in the kitchen. Happy cooking.